look, y'all, I'm going to drop this gem on y'all, and I'm going to let y'all go, man. I'm going to let y'all go. Watch this. This is the Indian training schools. They, y'all, they had schools to teach them how to be Indians. Watch this, y'all. Now, look what it say. What did they do in the Indian training schools? <laughs> Watch this. Such things, such as, I mean, they taught them such as forming and housekeeping. Now, y'all, now, come on, y'all. Come on, y'all. If they from this land, why they teach them how to form this land? <laughs> I want you to go to the Library of Congress and pull up the information about their former schools. About their Indian schools, y'all. Your laughter itself should be enough to show how ignorant you are of the history of indigenous people. Because all these schools have massive graves. You truly hate yourself that much that you try to steal someone else's culture. Now those schools were there to teach us how to be more human, civilized, because we were considered savages. However, your people, not by words, were not considered human. And there's a big difference. To the white men, you were considered property. And through centuries, the fight for equality continued. And now that this is coming to a reality, people like you are coming to indigenous people with this, trying to erase us from the map. But see, when we ask you to speak the language, to give history of the land, tradition, dances, people like you stumble because you have no ground. Slavery truly did its job to some of you, which it was to rip the identity that you guys had. And you are the perfect proof of it.